Today we are out in the park. I've got no enclosed shoes on. I'm walking through all these little bits of grass, seeds. Anishka's running through them, which she shouldn't be. That's why we're heading over this way. Gotta watch out that it doesn't go in their nose and grow in their nose. I've been told, at least. Or get in their eyes and stuff. Whew. There's a plane up there. I don't know if you can see it. This is a pretty big park. We've got two ovals happening. One way over there, which we'll go to. And this one that's been on renovation for several months now. You get the odd person who comes here every now and then, but it's not very popular. I don't know why, because it's a nice big open space, surrounded by houses and stuff. Ishka, bring it back. Good cow. You ready? She's a bit lazy. She'll sit the ball way ahead. So you walk up to it, grab it. I'll throw it back the way I'm walking. It means it takes a longer to get here. <laughs> so what I normally do with Hishka is I bring her out for a bit. Make her run after a ball. <sighs> and then I let her sniff around a bit because she's that ball obsessed. I like to give her a bit of time to smell the roses. Jeez, this is the first time I've come out here without enclosed shoes on. All these grass things are tickling my toes. Oh, she's got her A game on. <laughs> Sometimes it's fun to just watch her jump in the air and totally miss it. It's pretty warm today. Bring it back. Oh, she lost it. It's right behind her. Bring it back. Oh, she found it. Look at her doing the circling, typical border. Enough. That's so cute to relax. Go sniff. Off she goes. Smell who's been there. Who's been around. Leave her own scent. Tell the world that she exists. Oh, look at her run. Oh no, she's doing a shit. Come on, Ishka. Ugh. The only shitty thing, literally, about this car is that there are no bins. Oh, the lead nearly went in it. I find that she's her most happiest when she's out here. She just loves open space. Ability to run and be off lead. And off lead, she loves. She loves peeing. There's a girl with a chow chow as well, I've noticed. I don't know what the girl is with her, but the last few times I've seen her, her dog is interested in other dogs. Like it come, like she's normally got on a lead. But the last two times Ishka and I walked past, I don't know if the girl lets go of the lead on purpose because her dog's pulling. With that, but every time we seem to walk past, she always either lets go of the lead purposely or accidentally and just lets her dog try to follow Ishka around. Where is she? There she is. My dad has a Labrador who sniffs everywhere. He makes sure to sniff the whole place first before he even begins looking at you half the time. Yesterday I did see a greyhound. A guy had a massive greyhound. That's the first time I've ever seen it. Um, I do see people walking dogs in the neighbourhood sometimes on the very odd occasion. But rarely do they actually bring their dogs to the park, or at least whenever I'm here. Look at all this sniffing. Oh, she's doing a pee too. the 
sense. I'm gonna drop this shit bag on the ground. You ready? It's a bit warm today, so I won't throw the ball too much. Enough. This is what happened last time. Totally dropped it. You know, needed help to come out and find it. This dude over there doing exercise. He's looking over this way a couple of times. <laughs> That's the thing about quiet areas that are so open like this is that you, you get really anyone. So whenever you do see someone, you sort of stare at them. Because it's like, oh, what are you doing here? <laughs> and I mean, he's exercising, so I'm not sure if he's self-conscious about himself or whatever, but with us walking by, I suppose he's sort of like, oh, people, there's a train. Had to carry this shit bag around everywhere because there's no dumb bins. She's slowing down because she knows we're heading back home. I don't know about you guys, I've sort of had to work on it a little bit with her lead walking. Especially on the way to the park because she knows she's going so she gets excited and stuff. Look at her. Actually, like, no, I didn't want to go back. Um, but the walk home is normally fine after she's had a run around. Hop up. Clever girl. Oh, look at you. Hey, nice one. Come on. Come here. Ishka, yeah. There we go. Pick up the shit bag. Alright, let's go. I normally loosen the lead. I don't mind if she walks in front or anything like that on the way back home because she she doesn't normally pull. Sit. Okay. She knows the way. That's one good thing about walking your dog every day around the neighbourhood is that they start to understand where they need to go and they'll find their way around. So if they do get out of the yard, they sort of know their way around. At least you'd think so. Oof. It is quite a hot day today. <laughs> I love how they smell another dog and then they just pee over the top. But it's so good just to let them sniff stuff. Come on, kiddo.